lesson two, things can change in a year. In the last lesson, students learned about how the moon changes over the course of a month, and at this time, they're probably still doing those observations. You'll wanna to start today's lesson with a discussion of what they've been observing at home. Next, you're going to move into a discussion of the seasons and how they change over the course of a year. You'll start this with a game of charades. Break your class up into six to eight groups and give each group a season that they will act out. If your class isn't familiar with charades, you may need to explain that they're going to act this out without any type of talking. And the other students are going to guess how, are going to guess which season they are portraying. Allow some time for discussion. And then after all of the groups have gone, talk about what they noticed was consistent in the different portrayals of each season. The next thing students are going to do is look at their workbook and they're going to look at the pages that say My Seasons Album. Have them read the different, the different captions in each section and talk about what kind of pictures may go with those captions, practicing some predictions. Once they're done with that, you're going to pass out the pictures. Each student will get their own, which they will cut out and they will find the appropriate caption and they will glue that in there. Then they will need to label each quadrant either winter, spring, fall, or summer, whichever is appropriate. If there's still time at the end, there are pictures on the back of the workbook where students can decorate a scene to make it portray each of the different seasons. <laughs>